Hello folks, how you doing? Uh, we are taking a look today at the excess big dot sights for the Ruger LCP Max. We got our LCP Max here and our custom Falco cross drill setup. Uh, this rig was provided to us by the awesome folks at Craft Custom Holsters and my good friend Al, who is a great friend of the channel. But Falco makes world-class stuff and uh, Craft is one of their primary distributors. So I'll put a link in the description, all this stuff in there. You can see the double mag pouch is just beautiful. It's one of their belts. So I'm spoiled because I have good friends, but this is their setup. Anyway, the primary purpose of this video is to take a look at these XS dot big dot sites. Now, if we take a look at them, you can see we got a huge front dot and that is a tritium dot on there. And then the back. Uh, vertical line is also tritium. I'd say basically a vial turned on its side, and that has a uh, white outline. Now, uh, one of the neat things about this is that in addition to the big yellow circle that surrounds the tritium dot, which is extremely high visibility, if you hit it with a light, it also glows in the dark. So let me turn these lights out so here. See if we can see that effect real quick. And you could see that giant front ring. That is the tritium excess big dot front sight. That thing is gigantic and impossible to miss. Super cool. These particular sights are designed for speed shooting. And I have tested them pretty extensively. But these are incredibly fast. Underwood 380 plus P. XTP rounds, Ruger LCP Max, seven yards. We're going to draw from a Falco cross draw holster, starting with our hands up in the surrender position. Now you could see when the rounds were hitting, the wood is splashing as the rounds deflected off to the right because the target is angled a little bit. But that's the rate of speed and fire that you can achieve at a self-defense di distance with an Aruger LCP Max. They're slightly higher than normal profile, but not super big. They're not really snag prone. You know, I've practiced my draws with these a lot to make sure they weren't going to be a snag issue when they are not. But they're very, very high quality steel sights. Uh, I had no problem mounting them. So the uh, rear sight is a bit loose in here when you put it in. So you just hit it with a bunch of red Loctite and then it dries and it's like uh, iron in there. And then to adjust it, you drift the front sight left to right, which fits nice and tight with, uh, I didn't have to file mine or anything. Uh, and there was, it was not loose at all. So I didn't need any Loctite or anything in it. This is just dead on target. And okay, folks, here are the excess dot, big dot sights. We got the big giant front dot. We got the tritium rear dot. We have a variety of targets here at about seven or eight yards. We're gonna shoot them for you. Show that they're on target and easy to use. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna line the bottom of this circle right on top of that notch. It's very simple. Okay, so with the uh, sights, like I said, they're a little bit taller than standard profile, but they fit perfectly in here. This is a uh, relentless tactical suede inside the waistband holster, and you can see they fit no problem into this. We have the Falco uh, cross draw holster right here, and they fit no problem into this, nice and snug. I have uh, probably three or four different holsters that I have tried these with, and they fit perfectly and everything. So you're not going to run into any issue whatsoever. This LCP Max has been upgraded with a Galloway trigger, uh, the Sigurd trigger, Galloway mag spring, uh, Galloway recoil spring, Galloway trigger sprigs, the whole nine yards. So this, this is uh, fully pimped out. This is a excellent, excellent carry piece. Uh, 13 rounds, fully loaded, weighs 15 ounces. 
And with these sights, now the sights on this, it comes with a tritium front dot and a notch rear, and they're not bad at all, but these are much faster sights. You get them on target much faster. They're much easier to see in any lighting condition, and you can pick them up while you're rapid firing really easy. So I think these are a very significant upgrade. And I'd like to thank the channel Buckeye Ballistics who got access to send them out to this channel. Uh, actually, several months ago, it was so backlogged, it took me forever to get this video made. But these are great sites, and uh, Buckeye Ballistics is the one that got these sent out to our channel. So shout out to him. We appreciate that. And uh, yeah, these are really, really nice. This is a really nice upgrade for your uh, Ruger LCP Max. And like I said, whew, this Falco rig, just absolutely beautiful. So I'll put links to all this good stuff in the uh, description, but yeah, excess big dot sights, really, really nice, and I highly recommend them. And you could see why after you saw those shooting videos. All right, folks, thanks for watching. As always, freedom by me.